I received this apron as a Christmas present and I guess I should use it for pottery or cooking but I'm scared of staining it. It is, it is too beautiful for that and it's also white so I'm using it from time to time just to journal. Sometimes when I journal I wear it because I feel like I'm working somehow <laughs> or I don't know, I just feel more, more serious. This day I didn't want to journal in my desk. I received these flowers for Valentine's Day. We actually don't celebrate that day, but it decorated our house for a couple of weeks and it was of course super lovely. The bouquet was bigger, but um, the flowers were slowly dying and I had to remove half of it. I don't really like receiving, not receiving, like I, I don't really like having real flowers at home because they die and I honestly feel very sad um, but I, I could save a couple of them and dry them just to use them in my journals. This is what I did that day, just adding new things to my already decorated spread. Nothing crazy, just finishing what I've started a couple of days ago. Journaling at night after a busy day is my favorite thing to do. I try to share that moment with him, not being in two different rooms. That's why I journal again in our living room. But I'm really sorry if you can hear click, 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 click. But like he was playing his favorite video game right next to me. I hope you don't mind. I was decorating both of my journals at the same time, just stamping and adding stickers, which is another favorite thing to do.
sí. Vámonos. I started the day writing some things that I have to do that week down. Sometimes I forget that I have printed stickers inside an envelope and when I remember I just want to use all of them at the same time so this day was basically me using them. I wanted to share a little bit of what I do every day. I never finish, as you probably know by now, I never finish a spread the same day I started it. Um, just some days I feel like writing and other days I just want to decorate and I think that's normal and I think that's perfectly okay. Like just do whatever makes you happy. We took a trip this January and because we were driving a lot we started listening to Harry Potter's audiobooks on Spotify. Cada uno, dijo la profesora Marconaghan, resoplando a través de su nariz puntiaguda. Personas más populares y admiradas del colegio, Harry súbitamente era el más doreaban, diciendo Gracias Potter, te de We keep listening to them these days before going to sleep just to, you know, like relax our minds. But that night I fell asleep earlier and I played the last chapter while writing. I think that morning I just wrote. I love watching bad TV shows. It makes me realize that all the things that I've studied in college means nothing because a TV show can be extremely successful with the worst writing ever. So I take notes, like, I don't know, just watching bad shows because I'm studying them is the best excuse these days. I was decorating some pages that morning because I was free. Quite a bit throughout this process. I put my best foot. Joke to carry and go to 
I love making these little collages with stumps. I usually remove the ink with my nails, so I only stamp the part that I want to stamp. Um, even though they're pretty tiny, I love that by doing this you can still make them even tinier. While watching a drama, I wanted to write a couple of things I had to get out of my chest. I also wrote about the things that I did that week. And of course, because I wasn't paying attention to what was going on on the screen, I had to rewatch the episode as soon as I closed the journal. <laughs> 